Pokemon Heart Gold Part 96, and this music rocks. Uh, so at the end of the last video, Hunt got confused by Swagger or whatever, and uh, I want to bring in Lance and kill stuff, so I'm going to revive him. Because I want him to learn Eruption. If he could just learn Eruption, like, awesome stuff would happen. He uses Nighthead, Nightshade, but, uh, I don't know, it, it, I'm reading that as Nighthead, Nightoheadle, so I assume it's Night, uh, whatever, anyway, Lance is full revived, uh, Let's see, if it's going to keep using uh, Nightshade, I'm going to go ahead and just switch to him, I guess. Another Nightshade, and uh, Lance should definitely be faster. And, uh, hmm, I'm just going to go with a uh, Lava Plume, we'll see if it kills. I may not kill, but we'll try. And it kills, because Lance is cool. Awesome sauce. Alright. Get a level up there too. And uh, I got plus three special attack. That's not bad. And we get... Let's, let's see what this badge's name is since I have time to look. Um, pink. Okay. It, pink badge. See, this is like... First gen is the name where... Um, and we got TM84. I think that's probably Poison Jab. It used to be Toxic though. I think that you got, so that's weird. I'm not, I don't think I have Toxic yet, or do I? Uh, no, I don't. So I'm not sure where you get Toxic in this game. Uh, yeah, Doku... Do, Zuki? Or whatever. It's that. It's where the uh, accent mark is on the two, and I get confused. Uh, hang on while I get out of here. Yeah, I always get confused by that uh, accent mark being on the uh, thing for two. Or whatever, and I didn't heal. Hang on. Okay, so uh, we're gonna check down south here because I think there's some dudes who like block you off or some crap like that until you get to someplace another way. Yeah, they're like doing uh, construction or some crap, so can't go down to uh, Seafoam Island in that way. So, oh well. Not that we really wanted to go down there anyway. Although that's actually where the Cinnabar Gym is now because you know. Uh, Cinnabar Island got exploded. I'm gonna pretend that it got exploded by Mewtwo. Also, where's like, or was that, like, whatever viewing like zoo or whatever? That may have been in first gen. I think it was in first gen. I don't know. I get confused sometimes. Uh, anyway, so we're gonna head up to Lavender Town now. And this is probably gonna be the last part I record for tonight. Like these past, the past twelve and this one I've recorded like in a row. So kind of been marathoning, I guess. Uh, I, I want to get Allura up to do something decent because I know we've got Brock eventually and Blaine also and uh, against Misty, well, at least I can kind of stall her out while I heal other dudes. Uh, I'm not going to be able to do that against Voltorb though. Also, I may put Experience Share uh, on Allura because she definitely needs to be like high 40s before we like take on Misty, I think. Okay, he uses Magnet Rise. I assume that's what that was, is what it looked like. Uh, so that means it's not going to be able to be hit by ground attacks. So, okay. And uh, we'll go for Rock Blast then in that case. It's pretty weak anyway, so it should kill. And it does. Let's see, hey, uh, okay, that's uh, Magnemite. That thing might Magnet Rise, but, you know... I'm going to take the chance that it doesn't, or I guess uh, take the chance that it's slower than me, because I was pretty sure Voltorb would be, despite being uh, lower level. Okay, is this dude just going to have electric types maybe? 47, and yeah, I'm definitely going to put the experience share on Allura. Uh, re recoil, is that what's supposed to be like recoil, recoil? Uh, Faster than, it, faster than it, too. See, Electric is one of those types that, like, requires you to have a ground attack. Like, like, whenever you play through a Pokemon game, always have a ground attack. Like, always, because otherwise Electric types will, like, give you fits. Because it's like you can't hit them super effective, and, like, they're fast. 
and they're effective against a lot of stuff. But if you have a ground type, it's no problem. Okay, and I predicted the magnet rise. Yeah, dingy or something. Uh, and I used rock blast instead, so cool. Yay for prediction! Yeah, I like the school kid sprite in this one. It's pretty neat. Uh, so let's review the team. Right now we have Allura 41, Pages 43, Lance 44, Hunk 47, Keith 48, and Sven is down there hanging out at level four 31. So, okay. Uh, where's the experience share? Because Allura is probably going to benefit from that. Because I want her to be getting experience even if I can't uh, use her in the current fight. And I think she's going to sacrifice her Mystic Water for that, but oh well. Not a, uh, not a big deal. I'd rather, rather get her some more experience. Would have her be a little bit stronger. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Uh, what's that thing weak to? Uh, it's psychic type, so I don't really want to go. I don't, I don't really want to go to anything for this, so I'm just gonna stay in and waterfall it, I guess. Get it down there, because uh, my uh, ice and electric user is weak to psychic. Okay, this might be a good chance to switch to something. Uh, so we'll switch over to uh, we'll go to Pidge, I guess. Uh, Has a, he, I think he might be faster than Zatu. Oh, that, that, doesn't, that doesn't help me. I don't, I don't know what I was thinking there. Uh, we'll try. Or I should have done assurance because uh, it's super effective. But oh well. Aerial Ace does the job just as well. So cool. And he's packing a food. food oh, he's got a Zam. Holy crap. Holy crap. Uh, this is not good. Because, uh, you know, Zam is beast. Uh, we're gonna go to Lance because he's the only guy that's kinda fast and can maybe take a special attack. Uh, let's see what, what I'm gonna try to do. Uh, I'm too afraid Fire Blast will miss. Okay, I'm, thank goodness he set up a reflect instead of attack. So, because, uh, that, that thing, if it has Psychic, it probably could have swept us. Quite possibly, unless I. Didn't like I did with that stupid Espeon, and I uh, ran out of PP. That would have been how I would have had to handle that. Alright, uh, let me heal. I remember what I remember this song from. I remember it from, a uh, Stadium, or Stadium, Stadium 1 or 2. Uh, okay, it looks like this is a point of no return, sort of. I mean, you have to just go all the way to the end before you can do anything else. Uh, you can go behind this woman, but we want to fight her. Try to get Laura some more experience, because I really want her to level up. Oh, this is a this is a teacher, Sensei, Sensei no Kyoko. Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, hang on, reset. Holy crap. <sighs> Holy crap, guys. Uh, that was close. Okay, I don't know if you guys know about Sunkern. Like Sunkern is this Pokemon. Like uh, I like most people who know me like know this. Like Sunkern, where did we last save? Oh dang it, we're gonna have to fight Janine again. But, uh, that's okay. Uh, I'll just do that before next video. Uh, anyway, what I wanted to say about Sunkern, like, Sunkern is this Pokemon that, you know, it's it looks all cute and innocent with those, like, base, what, 30 stats or whatever? Yeah, don't believe the hype. Uh, Sunkern has this attack called Sunny Day. You guys may have heard of it. Now, when something else uses Sunny Day, you know, it's no big deal. Sun starts shining, you know, Chlorophyll activates, Solar Beam goes... You know, one turn, whatever. Uh, not a big deal. Now, when Sunkarn uses Sunny Day, though, oh man, it's it's something totally different. Like, what happens is Su Sunkarn is this little beast. What he does is he, like, makes the sun shine so much, your freaking face, mel like, melts. Like, your Pokemon just starts to melt, like... It turns up to like infinity degrees. Like your Pokemon melts, you melt, and like e even your DS starts to melt. Like your game card starts to melt, and like your DS starts to melt. So like if you see a Sunkern, like if it's wild, 
pray that you get to run away. Or uh, if you're if it's a trainer fight like that was, you better reset the game and like or eject your cartridge. Do do something. Don't let the thing use Sunny Day. That was close, guys. I almost thought we like lost all this progress we've been working on, but uh, instead we're just backed up to Janine. So uh, yeah, okay. I'm a little disoriented after seeing that Sunkern. Uh, bad memories, but yeah. Sometimes you can actually beat a Sunkern if. If you like sucker punch it or something, like if you're able to beat it before it uses sunny day, that's possible. But I don't know, it's it's it's, it's a risk, and uh, I definitely wouldn't want to risk my games. I don't know about you. Uh, anyway, uh, okay, I'm a little shook up. Uh, we're gonna end it here and pick up from behind that woman. So yeah, I'll just redo all this stuff and then get back to that woman. So cool. Uh, later days. Oh my gosh. Scary stuff.